Hi kids. Okay, today in Foundations, you are going to need your student notebook. And we are going to add our two trick words to the back of our book, to the trick words. So the first one is called. I heard that your grandmother called you on the phone. Called. Okay. So go to the C's. And hopefully you have your words in front of you. But if you don't, I'm going to just spell it out loud for you. Called. C-A-L-L. ED. And actually, I don't know why Foundations has that as a trick word, because call would be our glued sound all, right? And then we would add the ED uh, suffix. But Foundations has put this down as a trick word, so we are going to do it. Okay, and the next uh, trick word that we are adding to our um, book is water. Water. It is good for you to drink tons of water. Okay, so find the W's. And water is spelled W-A-T-E-R, water. Okay, so remember that um, words that end in the er sound at the end of a word are always going to be uh, a vowel-controlled vowel controlled R, and it's usually E-R, all right? Okay, so now let's add um, two new words to our dictionary. And remember, if we've run out of space, because I'm not sure where you are, because I'm not in front of you. If you run out of space under that letter, then go to the nearest letter that has an opening. But I do want you to get these down, these sentences down. Okay, the first one we are going to add is under B, vocabulary words, B, we're adding benches. Benches. Okay, and I am going to write it out and mark it up. Benches. And remember, this week we are studying adding the suffix, the vowel suffix ES, to uh, words that end in CH or SH. Benches. Okay, and here is the sentence, and I will write that along with you. The sentence is, <clears throat> who are the people on the benches? Who, who, Who are the people on the benches? Who are the people on the benches? And you know what? Everything's a trick word. On is not a trick word, but everything's a trick word besides on and benches. Can you believe that? I'm doing the consonant diagraph, but here's the tricky thing. Did you remember that it is a asking sentence? So it should have a question mark. Who are the people on the benches? Okay, and the next one we are going to do is, let me see. Let's go to the letter D. And our word is dashes. She dashes to the finish line. Dashes. All right, dashes. Again, mark up your consonant diagraph, the suffix. 
and the closed syllable, right? This should be good. This should be easy for you all. You're so smart. Dashes. Okay. And your sentence should be, Jack dashes to get to work. Jack dashes to get to work. And I'm going to add something that's not in my foundations book to work on time. Let's make it say to get to work on time. Jack dashes to get to work on time. Jack dashes to get to work on time. Okay, then we will mark it up. Jack dashes to get to work on time. Okay, so in Jack, did you remember the consonant diagraph? Dashes. But what I really wanted you to remember also is time. Did you remember that was a long um, vowel sound, silent E? So it was a V-E syllable. Okay. Okay, boys and girls, you are doing so well with foundations and you're becoming such great spellers. Um, thank you for your work today.